So for those of you who have not been to Jamaica and don't know what this rock is, this in Jamaica is called a Pum Pum Rock. Hi, it's V. Let's vibe! Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Today we're doing a long road trip and we're taking the old road for some of it so I hope that you will enjoy it. Come with me and let's drive! So it's the new Fresco gas station that is Fesco, my bad. That's out here and you know they have a tasty's party and the whole nine yards. It's like a convenience store inside the gas station. Yeah, so see the sign there. You know what that means for a Jamaican. If you're going to Portmore, you would take that left and go this left right here at the light. So the sign here says, Welcome to St. Catherine. And if we were going to take the highway, um, we would be making the right up here. Um, in a few seconds, traffic is moving a little slower than usual. But um, so yes, so right where you're, if you're able to see it, there's a sign that says Barita. So where this vehicle is going, so you would make that right to go onto the highway. But we have a little treat for you today, so you're gonna see some of the old roads. So stay tuned. Past the Sherwin Williams sign, you know, best dressed chicken right over there. High Pro Ace, a few things are out this side, and um, we're just about in Central Village. So, you know, that you'll see the Lasco. I think this is the Lasco building, the pink and the pink and white building. That's Lasco, but yeah, so we're heading out. So, for those who've not seen this side in a little bit, enjoy. So we're passing the St. Catherine Health Department. To our left, we just passed it, and then this is the Spanish Town Hospital. For the folks who've never seen it before, it's on our left as well. We have company there today, as you can tell. So we're driving through Spanish Town a bit. Um, yeah, I think it says we're on Barrett Street. The Spanish Town, why? WCA right to our right we just passed a while ago all right people from Spanish Town we're just taking the place enjoy it a little bit and we'll pick up in a few
make it. Yes, when we go back, we go to no one, no nice. The whole of this stuff is captured. We need advice. So we're coming up on the, the road that you would take to go to the GC Foster College. So you know that's the College of Phys Physical Education and Sports. So if you want to become like a teacher of physical education, if you want to be a masseuse, anything related to sports and physical education, you can go there. All right, folks. Alrighty folks, if you know, you know, if you've not been to Jamaica in a while, we're heading to the Bagua Gorge or we're there. Um, so we're heading around to where you'll be able to see f the flat bridge and that infamous rock. Don't worry, I will show you the rock. <laughs> for those who've not seen it ever, I think this will be a good treat for you. So. Just stay tuned and when we get there, I'll show you. Well, I'm gonna reach it, people, but I just think this is so beautiful, so I'm just sharing it with you. Yeah, I, I just believe, as I, I mentioned in one of my videos, that almost everywhere in Jamaica has this Holland bamboo. Look, Nick, look at the water brown. Look at the, well, let me not say, but the water look like um, red dirt. It's been raining a lot, but um, you'll get to see it when we get closer because the camera won't span that far and I'm not going to take it up, obviously. But yeah, I just feel like before I was mentioning that a lot of places in Jamaica have this whole Holland bamboo vibe. So we just pass the one for bug walk. As a matter of fact, all I hear is kind of have a little vibe, but you understand what I mean. So the tree is kind of meeting in the middle and it's overarching, it just has that look. But yeah, stay tuned. We'll be there soon. All right, folks. So we are here. I don't know if you can see the water yet, but you will see it soon. Um, at this point in the game, I don't know about anybody else, but anytime, anytime I am crossing the flat bridge, which is right up here, there's a stoplight there now. Back in the day, there was no stoplight. But anytime I'm crossing Flatbridge, I like to wind my windows down. Um, so yeah, that's what is popping right now. I know you usually see the vendors there. Don't worry. If you hear a little beeping sound, that's another thing that I do when I cross the gorge. Um, when I cross the bridge, um, the beep will stop when we go back, when we go over. So... <laughs> But um, yes, so you see it, folks. If you're not seen flat bridge in a while, or if you've heard about it and never seen it before, this is what it looks like. Or we passed it, so it looks like that. And then now we're I'm giving you a little bit of the gorge, so just stay tuned and enjoy until we get to the rock. So folks, story time, right? Although we passed it already, so I don't think the story will be as effective. But there's an area of the road that uses cement, right? So every time I pass it, it makes a little sound, like a sound that for me um, reminds me of when I just started driving. We said we get the car, you know, go to work and drive out. And why, tell me why two of the tire flat one time and just make that sound right in a half a tree to it to what the tire flat can you imagine how traumatic it was you know you just you just start on the road or something something and then boops you stop our stoplight and there it was so somebody else here check out the place um yeah but so anytime i drive here and the sound of the road that it makes um it reminds me of that experience but yeah that's been a while we're coming up to the rock at the rock Wow! So for those of you who have not been to Jamaica and don't know what this rock is, 
this in Jamaica is called the pum pum rock which means it just looks like the female genitalia the vagina so um, yeah that's about it all right folks so now you know this is the gorge beautiful and you have seen the rock you can't say me never shown us something new and this used to be A night, a hot spot, or like a we call it one of the sceneries that people would, one of the areas that people would. Hey, you you are are <laughs> <laughs> just see some of the women, but this used to be one of the areas that people would come by and stop because they want to see the rock. People for night, you know, the year we got um, I hope that you enjoy the footage and off we go again. Come on, let's go. Cause. So if you have not already subscribed to the channel and you want to see different places in Jamaica and this is something that you like, remember to go ahead and subscribe. The subscribe button will be in red if you have not subscribed already. If you have subscribed already, it will say subscribe. So go ahead and subscribe. So now that that is out of the way, thank you so much for subscribing and come on, let's go finish the journey. So around this side, when we were just coming in, I don't know if you remember seeing a gate. Um, that is because around this side, whenever it rains and it and the river overflows its banks, the gorge is closed. So no traffic can come in or out of the gorge. Um, so that is one way they use because all of this road here so can get flooded in the event of anything. Or not even here, so but down some more. But you know, people they close it off the gate so that they don't um, they close off the gate so that no one comes in. See the other gate here. So folks, we are entering Bog Walk. Woohoo! So when the gorge is closed, uh, people take this right and they go up to Sligoville side and um, come back into town. So if the garage closed, that's what they do. But we are in bug walk, folks. I think I'm going to wind up my window now, you know, because I can't manage the heat, the sound and everything. But I'll, I'll keep you all posted. In this spot is where we normally get our fruits and some. So when you left, when you're leaving town in the mornings, this was one of the areas that you'd buy your fruits or even if you come from um, another parish, coming from maybe Hanover, Moby, stuff like that. But not if you're on the bus, you know, because if you're on the bus, this isn't one of the stops that they're making. But otherwise, you know, this was something that we would be doing. So folks, for those of you who have not seen this area in a long time, I am happy to be bringing it to you because here one or no, this is because the highway, um, from the highway open, a lot of people don't drive on this road anymore. Um, a friend of mine, which they tell me, say, well, I have a fret driving on this road because mostly driver drive on this road now. Everybody else will take the toll. But, you know, it gives you an opportunity to see what it was before and, you know, just get take it in a little bit so y'all enjoy for a moment. Hello. Folks, look what's happening. I don't know if you can't see it. Well, yeah, you can't see it. I know. Yep. It's raining. The wiper blade them well quiet this morning. Let's hope that they stay that way. The wipe on my wipe them off seem like it helps. If you watch the last video, you know why I'm mentioning this because one of the time them almost get to me. Well, not even almost, they did. Because boy just didn't make a lot of noise, but here we are, and you know, hear a sound. But the rain. Well, that's a fire too now. Yeah. Now you, this, 
so now get like the pan green so if you're going to Mobi, you can take this turn that we just passed that left turn or there's another one at the top that we can take that's the one i'm going to take that will show you we'll pass the toll i'll show you where the highway um where you pick up the highway from in linstead but um yeah we're not sitting there i don't know what i said enjoy all righty so we're heading out <laughs> That's why you have to deal with it. <laughs> These people are still here. Look, hey, but they used to have jackfruit and stuff. This is like a staple here. So you always find apple, jackfruit, cane, you know, cane you find anyway in Jamaica. But yeah, I always have apples here. So if you if you're gonna take the toll, you'd make this right at that light that you see that person going. But we're not taking the toll. Look here, I wanna make sure you enjoy this, you know, because this is for y'all. People, you know how long I have not seen this side of road, yeah? I'm gonna take the road yeah, in a long time. How much years now? Years, see? So I'm gonna say the same thing, right at the train line, people are always there with something. Which is pretty cool. All around us so just look different. <laughs> this is so cool. So long we don't cover the road yeah? so long oh wow okay you know the highway cuts out all of that but the highway you know the, there's a price increase so um that coupled with the fact that i want to show you to what this part of the town looks like um that's why we're here so we're in charlemont now um so we're going through Show them the vibe of our go on music oh, time. How much price you going to? You know, take it all and I can't. Yeah, me I take it all. Right the money. Unity Valley. Yeah, I mean I want you have you looked at my tires? Mm. But we have come back, we take it all the way up. But yeah. Mm. People, when was the last time you saw this spot? Yeah. Especially if you're not well. If you're not from Jamaica and you haven't, or if you're from Jamaica and you haven't come home, you have not visited home in a while, you know that this is the usual road. So this is something that's familiar to you. But even my Jamaicans watching this, when was the last time you drove on this road here? Whether on bus or driving on your own. I'm sure it's, it might be a while. Because people, unless you're coming to Linstead or so, you don't really drive this side. There's always this smell when you're passing the backside and stuff. Um, that's there. Yeah, that dip in the road is still there from here. So, yeah. Bump me in. Caramosh. The Church of Christ. For the Uaton folks. refreshing though, I mean, I'm not telling a lie. Like I feel, I feel, you know there was a bakery out here so I sell nice yeah, stuff. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's a, 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 Somewhere uh, right here so. I've heard that open line in the town. Alright, I saw that in the door. Nick. Somewhere up, yeah, 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 yeah. That bakery though. You still do. 
Is it still there? Yeah. It's still there. Yeah. 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 People from this area, where's the bakery? If you know that bakery that I was talking about, but wow, look at this. Which town, which is what is name now? What you look like in that? Oh, the crystal bakery. Okay, but it's oh, yeah, we know you are. The people we are watching you now, as me about to tell her, please miss. That'd be nice. As you know, we have company in here. Some of some of them look like, more timid than others, but um, let's hold tight. Um, yeah. So we're about to we're heading, you know, to the area where we'd go and then we go to Mount Rasa. So that's why you're seeing this. I'm giving you a clip of this so you can, you know, enjoy it. If it oh. look like a funeral. Um, oh, that's my monkey man. Here right now. Don't put the funeral there? Yeah. Got that. And I never know if it's when people are fine. No, I've heard people mention it before. But mm -hmm. when I say a monkey man, they say, just know their name and say, oh, man, or something. Like but yeah, folks, if you've not seen this before, or you know, see this in a long time, like myself, yeah, that's why we have an extended version. So you get to enjoy it a little bit. If anything, and it I get too lengthy. I'll fast forward some of it, but at least you get to see what it is like. Of course, people are waiting for them taxi or them bus, usual, that's what I said. So if you're not from this area, you're not going to be waiting on taxi and bus, but people still not, because the highway is there, that means people don't live in these parts anymore. People still live here, so you know, they're going to be taking their taxi and their buses and that kind of stuff. So yeah. Kinda of look a bit lonely now, but that's all right. So somebody has sell banana and some. Oh boy, here we go. Somebody, man. I don't think they have phone the phone the road alone. People not drive around here again. Oh, so nice. Man, take it road like a film it. Oh, that's nice. That's that place. Look nice. hog plums if you're like me folks you never liked hog plums <laughs> I didn't do so the regular um lick up me don't know what them one they call so they are the hog plums where you have you find them like close to a river or something the yellow yellow ones what them get soft soft quick but then you have the regular um the other plums man that you find those you can eat them green or ripe those I will do but the hog plums are getting flat out Really not at that all folks, my truth. Mount Russa Primary and Infant School folks. So if I had a school there you go, pick up yourself. <laughs> Another story time as may I pass here so I remember. So back when this was the road of choice, I was about and not even the road of choice. I think the highway had opened um, back then, but um so we were driving here one day and rain, rain up pouring up. And then out of the blue, you just see the car swinging side to side. Nobody don't know what happened. 
you try to figure out what's going on Hydroplane. when you look. Um, we're in Pedro Plain. Hydro Plain. No, hold on a second. So, um, so the car just a swing, a swing, a swing. When you take a stop, there was an oil leak on the road. Cause it looked like a truck or something. They spill oil all the way. Um, so it happened about three times for the one journey. But the car just a swing, swing, swing. But thankfully we were safe and you know because you know when there's an oil spill you can't really I go on like you want to try to break or match your brake too hard because then it will send you but because you can't stop. But that was quite interesting, you know, just driving back past it, I remember that. Um it was scary at the time because you don't know, you know, you just don't know but thinking back on it. I'm happy that we were safe and all is well. Welcome to St. Anne, baby! It just seemed weird a while ago because of the, the regular sign, but welcome to St. Anne. As we pass, I signed it to me about another story. So, my nephew, right? And a soda oh, sign. Oh, Lord. Yes, it's a soda sign. So, my nephew, when we used to go, like, travel, go anywhere, and you tell him, say, you soon reach, like, you say, all right, you have to do four parishes before you go, or you reach where you're going. Every time I pass a sign, I say, see what sign what that mean? What that say? Him tell you. And then I say, so when we reach to the St. Anne sign now, can you know the St. Anne sign, they all the way um, down a trail on the side, they saw. So when we reach the St. Anne sign, and him I realize, so we now see no other sign, like him I say, are we still in St. Anne? still in St. Anne? You still in St. Anne? And we say, yes, we don't reach it. But yeah, that's something because St. Anne kind of broad, big. But yeah, ooh, look at this. So that the corner, there was one of them two where we swing. I ram up in a something. We ride one bank in the bumper, kind of lift off like a bit. But thanks be to God. We're still here, aren't you? Kind of play look nice too. Village Garden Primary Parish. and Infant School Village. Garden Parish. Okay, St. Anne is the garden. <laughs> Sir, your tire is flat. I wonder if you know that. Oh, I guess he does. Oh Lord, what a place okay. to get flat, man. Mm -mm. But um, yeah. Ooh, the scenery. People, Jamaica are nice. Look at the place, nice, man. It's just nice. Oh my gosh, it's just green and nice. The sun kind of gone and I hide a little bit from us, but y'all enjoy. See the place here now? See it here now? You're entering Faith Spen. Anybody who remember how Faith Spen used to act? Just make a comment below because Faith Spen, oh my, look like it closed completely. Uh oh, go drive through it and say, no, Mrs. Smoke. Mrs. Smoke, that means say, let's see if I right place this one. Yeah, let me see. This is smoke, so that means eh, one and two little cooking are going the same way. But people, remember, this used to be the spot for breakfast, lunch, dinner, supper. Well, I don't know about supper because I've never really driven past here for supper. But, uh, but um, yeah, the place, it's slower than usual. Like, this used to be the, the spot that you stop to get anything at all. Yeah. Your fish, your aki, your whole nine yards. But this is fate spend now, people. It kind of slow down a lot. Man, look there. Like a, a lot of the people. shops. Yeah, a lot of the shops. In, nobody not really did it. The man. Oh boy. Because of the angry. But that is, yeah, that, that, that is what happened because, you know, the, because of the highway, you know, the traffic, the traffic is not as much in here anymore. So, people are resorting to the highway than um, taking feed spin but for those who have not been here in a while I hope that was you know a refresher and give you an update on what it looks like now but yeah that is feed spin where was that name I don't have a clue folks but um, we're going oh boy that kind of yeah and I'm gonna blow my horn <laughs> So right at this spot to our right, folks, you know, this the, the, this is where I tried roast yam for the first time. Um, they normally have roast yam and stuff there. So if you're interested in that, then that is somewhere that you can check, check out. 
Folks, I don't know if you see that truck. Um, look to your right. That's the highway. So if we were going to, if we were on the highway, that's where we would be to our right. We see that windy sign. We'd be over that side. So they can look at us. We can look over at them. But you can't really look at nobody because the camera is fixed at one place. Oh, they're saying money is on this side. No, no. Not on this side either. Tana, yes. Ready? One, two, three, go. Ooh. <laughs> that was a long to do. Do you take it here? Or down some more? Is this one? All right, we're going down some more. That's another. So if you were going on the money leg, you, you take the, the toll on your right. But yeah, we may have a little tubes further. where we are but um yeah enjoy yeah yeah we are in money you know here's some here's a change with the fence but it's this part yeah some part change and i think you can drive through here so if you're going straight up yeah so we're in money look at this yeah we're gonna pass it folks from money to enjoy this room has a not much much change no go on. Alright folks, so now if you were going Fern Gully you would go straight ahead or just a little something right. But um so we're going this side. So you can get to St. Anne from well they're in St. Anne, what may I say? You can get to Ochi from Fern Gully too. Um and I think money the, the college is up on the hill but you can yeah, see pass here. Yeah yeah we just pass it just now. But yeah so you can get to OJ from Fern Gully as well as um, so I think this is my last story time people for today all right look to our right right over here so we am gonna slow down Anna, and I'll show you with the arrow so I'm on a bus coming from I think it's Mobe um, and everything nice and cool the bus, bus are coming this is years ago and when we look me just look to the side, me see smoke and people just have bail out of the bus, you know. <laughs> you know, Jamaicans, when, when a problem, them not, not name orderly. So everybody just have bail out of the bus. That was something else. Me I think to myself, say, boy, you know, your parents are going to do their ears, say, um, you're in a bus catch a fire and all kind of stuff. But that was quite an interesting um, experience because we ended up having to take something go. It's the Fern Gully that I was showing you before. We had to take a bus now. Go into Ochi um, and then get back, get something from Ochi to go back to town because we couldn't get anything from here so to get into town directly. But oh, that was another close one, but we give thanks that we're still here. This is just for the folks who might be from this area to enjoy a little. So if you are from around here and you have not seen it in a while, Please enjoy. Step outside, cola bite you. Oh my gosh. That's what I'm saying. We say we have the one more entrance to take on Golden Grove, but if Golden Grove is like right there, it's like at the almost the end of the tour, but you can take it. So what's the point? Yes. Let's just in case you won't be happy but she's sleeping and she wake up and come out of the hill. <laughs> She not really sleep with the people. She a cuckoo. You hear her? <laughs> she 
the Kakar is a little gone. But I mean, if we're in Golden Grove, then it, it makes more sense to just, you know, just do what we gotta do, which is gonna be interesting. Let me see if I remember where I'm going now. Mighty Father. Yeah, long time I'm gonna so, yeah, so we're turning this way. We're gonna make this. So we're going to the. Yeah, so we are going to be real, sir. Watch it. Yeah, so we, we make this right here because we're going down. Jackie Hill, not there. Yeah, so. the other side. Other side. Yeah. Yeah, but we now have a Jackie Hill today. We're going, we're going down the hill. <laughs> Golden Grove folks, we all enjoying it. Watch out the smooth road on and all. <laughs> so people, here we are driving, right? I mean, I look on the road and say, I call road them in so you're casing now to me. I mean, I have no, but you know, I have nobody behind us. You want to carry it? <laughs> like she has said, the road so lonely, not even one somebody in the behind But she talked too soon because she had another carrier. People still live around here, you know, people there. And I like the people don't live around here, it's just that people don't, if you have the, to choose between here and the highway, lots of people will choose the highway because they're not so sure about it. One, how the road looks, they want to cut out the time, but it doesn't really seem like it's taking that long. And nobody is um, there. Yeah, true. The traffic is less, <laughs> so it, that comes, um, that is one advantage, I guess. But here we are behind the truck. So, yeah. Folks, if you are from this area, please enjoy. This is what it's you know. Steer field. Okay. So you have steer field and steer town. Oh, look at that. Interesting. Steer field, St. Anne. I'm going to try and see if I can remember where that rest stop was. I know it's somewhere close to here, so but I can't. I mean, I don't know if I go remember when me. You understand? Somewhere close by. Right there, so I think it. Right there, so I think it was. Make sure I want kind of spot. Let me look. So, me, me no remember. But I somewhere off here, so man. And I used to have wow. one latrine. Look at that day. Wow, it's nice. It's so beautiful. People, if only you could see it. I want to pee. Want to pee? Oh, man. Hold on, folks. We gotta find that rest stop. <laughs> Hold on. As you heard, someone on the trip had to do an emergency rest stop, so we take a little stop. But I do hope that you're enjoying the trip so far. How is it going so far, folks? Let me know. Are you enjoying it? Or not? So there you have it. Thank you so much for joining with me. I hope you enjoyed the journey. I know it was long, but I saw it going, especially if you use the old road. The journey is going to be longer so i hope you enjoyed it i hope for the folks who didn't see the old road or have not seen it for a long time it was a refresher see you in my next video don't forget to subscribe and have a wonderful day